So with this specific example that I'm using right here, the gentleman, his name is Doug Bell, and Doug has a farm operation in Uruguay for wealth preservation. It's an investment platform. And he wanted these videos to help him. What I knew right away was that I was gonna have to sit down and put Doug on camera and have him explain to me what he wanted to do. You know, appearing in a video creates familiarity. So by people watching him and being comfortable with Doug, your client, instant rapport. Correct. When you meet face to face, there's an instant connection, an instant rapport once they've seen your videos. So they feel comfortable with you. Doug is a brilliant guy. He was a farmer before he owned many supercuts and then sold them and went into this farming thing. And to have him come across on camera, nothing is more credible than Doug talking about Doug's product than Doug. Everything that you're trying to do with your messaging, your video online is increase credibility. So we sat down, Doug, three different times. It was Brian that helped me out and did a Q&A. And I asked Doug questions off camera so he could edit me out and asked him to talk to me like a layperson. This was gonna end up on his website and YouTube. So that's what we did. We went through them. We edited them into different spots. And then all of a sudden I get a ping from Yelp. And then I got this five-star review from Doug. And so right after I got that, I called up Doug. And I said, Doug, thank you so much for your Yelp review. He goes, Steve, I have to tell you something. So before you pitched me this idea, I was a little skeptical. And I didn't know how this was going to work. It was going to be on our website. It was going to be on YouTube. He didn't understand how YouTube worked fundamentally. So I talked him into it. We did that series of videos. And he specifically closed out that syndication based on those videos. And he knows it because a guy came up to him at a wealth conference and said, you're Doug Bell. I know you because I've watched all your videos on YouTube. If you cater it and film it and pitch it to the right audience, the video can really knock it out of the ballpark for you.